Hi guys and welcome to another week here on Badger's Life where I record what I do during the week and put it up on the internet for you guys to see. Uh, as you can see I don't have the black background this week. That's because the room that that's normally in I'm kind of sorting stuff out. So this is what happened during the week. Hey guys and welcome back to Badger's Life. Um, taking that week off has actually helped a little bit. Um, as you know, the reason why I took the week off in the first place was just to recharge my batteries. But uh, then we had what happened with Charlie on, on the Sunday happened. So it ended up being a week of trying to cope with not having... And I know it's just, for most people out there, it's a pet. And I really shouldn't be in so depressed over losing a pet. But it's something... It's like having somebody who's lived with you for 11 years just disappear everything reminds me of him um every time i feed my other cat gizbo i uh, i get reminded that i'm not feeding charlie every time i go into the front room and don't see him sat on his chair it reminds me of him so uh all last week i was quite depressed so Kind of glad I didn't film most of that because I spent most of the time cuddled in, uh, huddled in a corner crying. <sighs> yeah. Um, on Tuesday I had a panic attack slash seizure type of thing. I'm calling it um, basically my whole body convulsed and I ended up curled, curled up in a ball twitching. And then apparently I went to sleep. And woke up an hour later, so I don't remember going to sleep. I just remember shaking, crying, and cuddled up in a ball. And then I woke up an hour later, so I'm going to be speaking to my doctor about that because if that's happening while I'm still on medication, it might mean that the medication isn't working. So that's something I need to speak to the doctor during this week. Uh, so yeah, that's what happened all last week. Uh, today. Um, I decided to go for a walk and went over on my ankle. Now, my left ankle, I have very little uh, cartilage left uh, on the, um, the ankle itself. I forgot what it's called now. Basically, I've got um, a, like a little... What connects your ankle and your foot together? I've got like very little cartilage left. And um, when I walked across the field, my foot went that way. And I don't know if it was a branch or my foot, but something went... <coughs> and I ended up in a lot of pain. So I hobbled back home. I put my foot inside of a uh, ankle sock and I've taken some painkillers for it. And hopefully it should be fine. Um, I'm looking at it and I can see my foot is actually inflaming a little bit so hopefully it's fine because tomorrow I'm off to the Avenue Q open day to put my name down for the auditions so hey hopefully my foot's okay for then so yeah that's that was my week on my Sunday Um, I'm just about to sit down and watch a TV series called Dance 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 which I'm loving it's inspiring me to create some more dance routines um, and hopefully I can get to use them sometime <laughs> in the future. Uh, but yeah, it's inspiring me to do things and my brain is getting into gear this week. I, I've written down a timetable of what I'm going to do for this week and whatnot. So let's see how this week goes, shall we? Bye. So yeah, this is what I've done to my foot, all here. It's not cartilage, it's ligaments. I have very little ligaments in this area. And as you can see, it has inflamed again. It, no, I normally do have a lump here because of all the ligaments I've actually ripped in my lifetime because of my dancing. Uh, don't mind my toes, they're very disgusting. But uh, yeah, all here, I've basically pulled something here. I'm going to go see the doctors in the morning, see what they say, so I'm going to put this thing back on for the rest of the night 
and hopefully everything should be fine. Yay! Hello everyone, it's Monday morning and I'm off to the doctors to find out exactly what I've done to my foot. Because I'm still in a lot of pain from last night, so let's hope I haven't ripped another tendon in it, which means I'll have very little, even more gone. They said last time I had two left, so I really hope I haven't done that. I think I might have just bruised it mainly because it hasn't swollen as much as I thought it would have done, so... But yeah. I think the best thing is painkillers and uh, bandage, and somebody's messaging me, so I'm gonna stick it. I'll see you soon. Bye! <sighs> hey guys, so... Uh, a bit sticking up there. That's what that to. Hey guys, so I'm back from the doctors. Basically, they're saying I've got a bad sprain, so I have to keep off my foot for a while which is going to be fun since I have the open day kind of slash put name down for audition for having a queue today and the auditions in two weeks time so uh, let's see, hope I don't do a lot of movement and the wonderful thing is because it's on my left foot as usual I'm putting all my weight weight, weight Putting all my weight on my right foot, uh, right leg, which is the one that has sciatica, so that's playing up. And hi, Gizzy. You tell them. Uh huh. He's kind of after me, pasty that I got. So, uh, so yeah, my left foot is in pain because of the sprain, and my right leg is in pain because of the sciatica. So, I, after today, I'm probably not going to be able to walk. So. Yeah, I know. I'm not going to be able to walk. So this is going to be fun. <laughs> so let's see how the rest of the day goes, shall we? <laughs> Hi guys, so now I'm setting off to Leeds to meet Vincent uh, to head off to Wakefield to go to this open day slash audition dinghy for Avenue Q. Um, I actually put my dinner in the oven, uh, misread the time and realised I wouldn't have time to eat it before I have to come out, so find, um, thankfully it cooks and I'm about to stick it in the microwave and I'm going to have to eat it when I get back. So <laughs> I thought it was half past three when it was half past four and I had to set up at five, so half an hour cooking time, it got done, couldn't eat it, had to run, so uh, I'm hungry and I'm going to have to eat when I get home, so. Let's see how Vincent is. I'm here vlogging Vincent, vlogging me. It's getting better. Yeah, okay. It's all getting better. Getting better. One minute, uh, Vincent. Hello. 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 Hey guys, so uh, me and Vincent have just finished at the um, open day for having new Q thing, the launch day. Uh, he's gone home on his bus now and I'm about to go catch mine in about 10 minutes. It's bloody cold out here. But yeah, uh, we're both excited about possibly being part of this project. Uh, the only downside I see is the fact that there is some fees to be part of it because it's a company. Um, to pay for things like the costume and the hiring of the puppets for Avenue Q they're asking the people that are chosen to have a part to put money towards the production so it's a tight thing if I do get a part I mean I can save like five pound every two weeks and have enough to pay for it because they have up until the end of June to pay the money there is altogether so I am going to still audition for it, uh, me and Vincent are going to get together either this weekend or next Wednesday during the day to just rehearse the, because we have to do songs that each character that we're wanting to audition for, we can audition up to three characters, you have to learn the song to sing and then there is certain characters of certain types of voices as well so you have to cope with those, so yeah, we're going to sit down and discuss and try to sort some stuff out so 
I'm gonna put this phone away now because my hand is getting cold so I'll see you guys later bye hello everybody and welcome to Tuesday morning where I'm feeling a little bit refreshed after having a very 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 long sleep yes I've been asleep for about 12 hours <laughs> and I've just woke up had myself some breakfast slash dinner because it's now like one in the afternoon so yeah uh, my plan today is to tidy up the front room do some writing and this evening do some filming so because that lovely uh, top five movies video that I was meant to bring out like three weeks ago still hasn't come out because of everything that was going on in my brain and everything that was going on at home so I want to get that filmed and I want to try to get that out by the end of today so if it hasn't I'm an idiot if it has way <laughs> so yeah that that's my plan for today so see you guys later on Good morning everyone, it's actually Thursday today as I completely forgot to vlog yesterday on Wednesday. Yeah, uh, my head has been a bit screwed up and I've been sleeping quite a lot. I've been feeling very very tired, very very low energy. I'm not eating very well at the moment because my appetite's gone down as well, which is kind of strange for me. Normally when I'm depressed I eat a lot because that gives me comfort which is the reason why I, I weigh almost 15 stone but yeah uh, my appetite's gone down I'm constantly tired but I'm gonna have to get on with life and get started on figuring out what to do for this audition in two I think it's in two weeks time not this Sunday it's next Sunday so uh, so yeah, basically I have to learn some songs, um, I have to learn how to do some character voicing for the people I want to uh, audition for, and I have to make a sock puppet. And while this, I have to look after this little guy, because he's been very, very lonely. My hair's a bit of a mess today. Mm. But yeah, uh so today I am behind on housework, so I'm going to just do a load of housework today. I'm going to stick some music on, do some housework, get it all sorted, and then sit down and do all the other things I need to do. What? Constantly talking to me. <laughs> I love you. Okay. And I'm going to sneeze, so I'll see you guys later. Thank you! Oh. I hope I'm not coming down with the cold. Bye. <clears throat> I'm not greedy at all. It's just I haven't eaten all day because my appetite has been a bit weird. So this is basically the whole day in one thing. I'm probably not going to eat it all. I'm probably going to have half of this and put the rest inside the fridge and then microwave it tomorrow. So basically it's pasta, bolognese, but I don't have any mints. So I cook some burgers and chop them up. So yeah, that's how my life is. Basically, I'm kind of down to the why when it comes to food at the moment because I get paid tomorrow and I, I'm i making sure because of, you know, money worries and everything that I get just, I spend enough on food to just last me for the two weeks, uh, maybe with like one or two meals over. So, I mean, I've still got some food inside the freezer and inside the cupboards right now, but uh, just to make sure I always go over a little bit so I've got about four meals left inside the fridge and freezer and the cupboards and whatnot all together so tomorrow is shopping and just getting another two weeks worth of food so yeah <laughs> and I, I I like what I like to uh, normally I mean what I do when I make pasta like I have done is I make some uh, mince and I also make some chicken and kind of mix them all together and have what I call a meat medley uh, pasta meal <clears throat> because I'm a greedy fat bastard and I've realised I've just sworn twice on this uh, channel and I've never done that before but I don't care so yeah I'm sitting down and I'm going to watch the brand new season of Legion uh, which is an X-Men spin-off kind of thing 
which I don't know much about, so I'm going to watch that. Rich just watched it this morning, said it was quite good, and now I might like it. So I'm going to have my pasta. I've got a lemsip in there because my nose is feeling a bit, mm -hmm. and it's very cold, so I have the heater on. So because I have a little, I have a little heater in the room now. Ah, so see you guys tomorrow for the many things I'm doing tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. Hey guys, so I've just finished watching Fox's Legion. Uh, it's set in the X-Men universe and I believe Legion in the comics is Xavier's son. That was a weird hour long episode. It's hard to put my head around it because it's, it's the guy has mental health issues. Um, he sees and hears things a lot, which he thinks he's crazy. It's actually part of his power, and it's in a mental institution. And the way they filmed it, you didn't know when you were when he was in the mental institution. What was a memory? What was real life? It got slightly confusing for me. <laughs> I'm going to watch the next episode when he comes out next week. But that was very. Very confusing. Yeah. So it's now 10 o'clock. So I'm going to start getting ready to go to sleep. Because I want to be up early in the morning. Because I need to call the doctors. Get a new sick note. Go to the doctor. Uh, the shopping. Go to the housing. I've got a lot to do tomorrow. So see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hello everybody, it's Friday and this very bitterly cold morning and there's snowflakes starting to come down so I think it's going to start snowing today. Yay! Uh, I'm just on my way up to the co-op to get money out so I can go and do everything I need to do today which is go to the doctors, uh, go shopping, go to the council and everything like that. So. Oh, bloody hell it's cold. <laughs> Uh, it's got to be one of those days, I think. I had about four hours of sleep altogether in very small patches. My brain decided to do the thing last night of let's go, let's uh, do a rerun of everything you've done in your life and all the music you like, even the ones that you don't know the, uh, the words to, so we'll just loop around the same song over and over again. Oh, yeah. Anyway, how are you doing today? Oh, tree. <laughs> uh, Alright, I'm going to get off. I'll see you guys later on, and let's see if it's white later on, shall we? So, bye! Whew. Well, I'm finally back from doing everything that I needed to do today. Got the sick notes from the doctor to send off to ESA. Sorted out the housing stuff, went shopping. Uh, and my legs are, oh, my right leg is killing me, or my left foot is killing me. I can hardly walk. Ugh, so I'm home, and I just put the food in the oven, and that's it for me. I, I can't do any more. I had a slight panic attack as well on the bus. I had to really focus on a game on my, on my phone, because I couldn't breathe properly. I was, I was twitching. And fingers were doing this all the time, so like focus on this game. It's a game that uh, I have to solve puzzles, so it's using my mind, keeping me active. Just wait till I get home and then breathe. <laughs> so yeah, I'm feeling a bit weird at the moment. So I'm kind of a bit jumpy and twitchy, and my eyes won't stop blinking. Uh, so I'm going to rest. <sighs> I'll see you guys either later on or tomorrow, so bye bye. Hello everyone and welcome to Saturday. I'm actually feeling pretty good today. I've actually got energy and I've actually got drive to do stuff today. So as you can hear in the background, the washing machine is on. I'm tidying the whole house. I'm getting all sorted. 
Uh, I've got somebody from the fire department coming around today to do a fire safety check because my smoke allow up here died the uh, yesterday and just kept on beeping constantly and now it's completely dead so they're coming around to look and see if they need to install a new one even though I've got one at the bottom of the stairs as well that they installed a couple of years ago so they're going to come around and do that uh, so yeah my my whole plan today is to get all the housework done that I've been kind of lacking doing for the last couple of weeks because I've been so down and so depressed so get that done get some writing done get some filming done and yeah energy I have energy it kind of feels like I've had coffee bro I don't like coffee so <laughs> right I will see you guys later on bye so yeah that was my week I sprained my foot I went to the open day for Avenue Q and felt a little high and then a little low during the week so yeah i have a very strange time sometimes don't i uh if you guys haven't already subscribed you can press that button down there or you can press just here and it will subscribe to the channel which means you'll be able to see when i put up a new video every week or you can click here and see a video that youtube thinks you might like of mine so until next time guys see you later